TBI, traumatic brain injury, is becoming better understood generally in the public. Up until quite recently, you know, even if people had a traumatic brain injury, the courts didn't really acknowledge it. Medicine didn't really understand it. Um, but now, as medicine comes to understand more and more how a traumatic brain injury happens and the effects of a traumatic brain injury and the long-term consequences, these are cases that can be brought into court. So um, for people who have traumatic brain injury, I see a lot, a lot more cases coming to court where people have a brain injury before a lawyer would not have taken the case, you know, the court would not have understood the case, and now we're able to take these cases and present them to a jury and uh, you know, get good medical documentation, good medical evidence to present the case uh, in court. It's just a growing area of the law, something that is becoming better understood, and uh, I think the future is gonna continue that trend. There are different, different kinds of traumatic brain injuries. You can have a serious traumatic brain injury with a fractured skull and bleeding in the brain where the, the uh, injury is obvious. But most traumatic brain injuries are, they're called mild traumatic brain injuries. Mild doesn't mean the injury is mild. Mild just means that at the time of the uh, incident that a person has a slight or short-term confusion, loss of consciousness, a dazed uh, effect. But that, mi quote, mild traumatic brain injury can cause long-term effects. And what it does is it causes tearing of the, they're called axons, the brain cells that transmit the electricity through the brain, transmit the uh, electrical impulses. And so there's new testing, there's a new MRI, it's called diffusion tension, diffusion tension MRI, DT MRI, which is an MRI that specifically can determine if there are shearing or if there's shearing or tearing of the axons um, or the neurons in the brain. And this is relatively new and it can help you uh, prove a case, whereas before there was really no objective evidence to prove these cases.